The Starting Point Step 1, Riders must stand in the allocated box. Step 2, the mechanic must hold on to the bike while the engine is off. Step 3, riders are to proceed onto their respective bikes when the starting light goes off. Step 4, mechanic must release their hands once their rider is on their bikes. Step 5, bikes are to be positioned before the line, and riders are required to start their bikes and proceed to move off. Changing of rider Step 1, riders are required to ride at 10 km per hour at the paddock lane, you will be given a penalty of $100 to anyone who breaches this. Step 2, for strictly rider relay or replacement can be done without engine switched off and or on the stand, example, without refueling, etc. Ensure your bike is behind the line. Refueling Step 1, you will receive minimum of 2 minutes to do refueling. During refueling, no further action can be performed on the motorcycle. Step 2, during any refueling put stops the motorcycle must be stationary for a minimum of 2 minutes so that the process will be carried out in a safe manner. The timing will start from the time the motorcycle is put the bike stand for the refueling operations. Step 3, the number of people attending the refueling is limited to two, one refueler and one fireman. Take note, at the start of the practice, each team must appoint one person for fire safety duties. This person must be equipped with a reliable fire extinguisher against fuel fires, and no refueling will be allowed without the presence of this person. The pit marshals will monitor during refueling. Step 4, the third rider will be appointed as a fireman on standby with a fire extinguisher. The fireman must direct the jet of his fire extinguisher from the box to the pit lane and facing towards the bike. The fireman needs to hold the fire extinguisher until the mechanic has stopped refueling. Step 5, the mechanic can remove the paddock stand once refueling has been done. Step 6, at this point, the timer is still running. Riders may start the engine and wait for two minutes to be up. Ensure your bike is behind the line. Once the timer hits two minutes, you may move off and continue the race. Now that you watched the safety demonstration video, it's time to race. Have fun and good luck riders. Enjoy your time at the 3 hours endurance race presented by Mobile One Racing, this Saturday November 20th at KF1 Karting Circuit. Sanctioned by Motorsports Singapore.